Hi, Pavani. How are you? I'm fine, sir. Uh, about okay. you, sir. I'm good. I'm good. So, you just tell me about yourself, Pavani. Okay, sir. First of all, thank you, sir. Allowing me to introduce myself. My name is Pavani, and I'm from West Bengal District, Andhra Pradesh. I have completed my bachelor's with a specialization of computer science in the Dhulu Narayan Raju College in the year of 2021 by holding a 89 percentage. After that, my intermediate is also completed in the Dhulu Narayan Raju College by holding up 79 percent. Mm-hmm. After completing my graduation, I worked as a customer care executive in Reddy and Reddy Hero Automobiles, Bengaluru. I worked as a CCE for six months as a customer care executive. My responsibility is to taking care of the customers' feedback. Mm-hmm. After that, I also worked as a Aqua Lab assistant for eleven months. As a Aqua Lab assistant, my responsibility is to assist the lab Aqua in charge. After that, with the interest of the programming. i wanted to learn python full stack development i'm currently learning python full stack development course in vcube software solutions okay. in that course i learned python html css javascript mysql django we are currently doing the project called crm customer manage customer relationship management okay good so, good so so in python how much you rate yourself you know 4.5 4.5 good so what is the use of variables Um, variables are mainly building blocks in the programming or any program variables mainly store the reference of the object with the respect to data type mm-hmm. they are mainly stores the reference mm-hmm. normally if you don't if you don't use the variable if you use the hard coded value if you want to change the value in any other next time you have to change that throughout the whole program okay got it but got it. if you use the variable you just simply modify that the starting sir Okay, good. So, what do you mean of dynamically typed programming languages? Dynamically typed, uh, the type of the variable is decided during the runtime. Okay, is Python dynamically typed? Yes, sir. Okay, good. So, what is the difference between break and continue? Break is easy to come out of the loop. Continue mm-hmm. is used to skip the current iteration and move to the next iteration. Okay, good. So, what is the main difference between list and tuple? A list and tuple are the sequential data types in Python. A list is stored. A list is used to store the heterogeneous values, and list can be modified. A list follows the order. As same as tuple is also a, stores the heterogeneous values, which follows the order. But list can be modified. Tuple cannot be modified. So okay. list is mutable. Tuple is immutable. Okay. So except mutability and immutability, is there any other difference? Yes, sir. There is a performance difference, sir. Mm-hmm. As we know, list is the modif. List can be modified. So the memory. Is allocated in the memory allocation to the different different places or different addresses. Mm-hmm. But tuple is like it cannot be modified. So we declare tuple is at once. So there is a high chances to uh, store the data in adjacent memory locations. Good, good, good. So it's like for example, I am having a list like this: ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty. I want alternate elements like I want twenty, forty. Okay. Do you really need loop to do all these things? You can. Can you do without uh, slicing? Without slicing. I mean, with slicing. Can you do with slicing? Yes, sir. Just do with slicing. Good, good. Okay. Can you write a program to check whether given number is prime number or not? Prime number. Prime number. Prime number. Yes. Okay, so what do you mean of list comprehension? Creating the short way, short way of creating a list. Is short way of creating the list. The okay. List comprehension. Good, good. Can you write an example like, I want you to find the square of even numbers, square. cube of odd numbers from one to ten, and meaning I want to create a list like this. How do you do? 
can I normally write the list? No, I mean, yeah, list comprehensive way I want. Example list can I take? So it's like example means if it, for example, from one to 10, if it is odd number, I want to cube it. If it is even number, I want to square it. Okay. With all these, I want to create a list. Yes. Even number square or number Odd cube. number cube, that's it. Good, but you want to keep if that side, if else that side. Am I correct? Yes, okay, good. Good. So tell me what is the difference between remove and discard? Remove and discard. Remove also removes the, the particular element and discard is also removes the particular element. But if you use remove to remove the an existing element, it raises an error. But discard is not like that. It if the element is there, it removes it. If it's not there, it cannot raise the error. Okay, good. Good. What is the main objective of set? Set. Where we generally use set? Unmodified data. Like we don't want to follow the order. Okay. So that in that situations we can use the set. Okay. Other than that, you don't have any other? Yes, sir. No? Okay. Good. No worries. So what is the use of list of arguments function? List of arguments. If you don't know how many arguments can be uh, Pass, we want to pass to the function with in that situations we can use the list of argument functions okay, okay. what is the difference between return and yield return returns is re, once we return the value it cannot go back to the function or the then written after the written element statements cannot be executed but if you use the yield uh, we can uh, return the value one by one if you want to return the values uh, like multiple values we want to if you use the return there we want to store the values in different data structures to return them but yield is not like that we can return the one by one values okay good good can you write a function like your function has to take the input as a string yes, sir. and it has to count number of vowels in it number of vowels. it has to return number of vowels in the given string okay so i want in a function yes okay. String. String exists. Your function has to take string as the input. Count. Count. I want count of vowels. Okay. Good. Okay. No worries. What is the use of lambda functions? Lambda functions are anonymous functions, which means lambda functions cannot have a name. If you want to pass a small functionality to the another function, we can use lambda functions. Okay. okay. What is the difference between map and filter? Map maps the elements in the list. Filter is used to filter the elements based on a condition. Okay. Good. What is the use of uh, you know object oriented programming? Object oriented programming is a different way, different approach to rewrite the programs. And the object oriented programming is a paradigm. Already we are having scripting and procedural oriented programming. Then what is the point of having object oriented programming? So what, what is the advantage with the object oriented programming? If you use scripting, we just normally write without any plan or like that. We can normally write the func program. If you use functions, our functions can be provide code usability. But in object oriented programming, first we it follows the bottom up approach which means we firstly initialize the data and we have to make a plan to write a program. Uh, it reduces, it also provides the code reusability. Okay, okay. 
good so what is the difference between instance variable and class variable instance variables are stores the particular data particular data to the class class variable store instance variable store the uh, instance level data data and mm. class level class class variable store the class level data okay very good what is what do you mean of method of overriding changing the behavior of your child class in the changing the behavior of your parent class parent class method in the child class is nothing but method of method overriding. overriding very good so what do you mean of operator of overloading operator of overloading yes to extend the behavior of the operator mm -hmm. is the operator overloading good 